Hey everybody, what we're doing today is I have painted these pieces white and what we're going to do is we're going to do a glazing technique on it to add some gray details to this. This has a really nice um, kind of design on the top drawers. It also has a lot of wood grain to it that you can you can see and what's going to happen is that glazing technique is going to just settle down into those grooves and look really nice. So what I've done is I've just taken this Valspar glaze and I've mixed in um, just some gray paint that I like the color of that I use quite often and that just thins it down and makes it easier and more workable. Um, gives you more dry time as well. You could add some flow throw through it to slow down the dry time. Um, I don't see the need in that, but you could do that if you felt like you needed more working time. Um, to thin it down a little more, I've added just, just a touch of water to it. Basically, we're just going to take a, a chip brush or just a paintbrush and be messy. On the details, I want to be sure that I really get into those grooves so that they will really pop when we're done. It'll look like a real hot mess at first, but it'll come together. Now for this part, you can use your shop rags or you can use baby wipes. But we're just going to take most of it off. And you can do this as light or as dark as you want. It's all about what your preference is. I quite like it light. But some people may want it darker. But I just want it to set down in those grooves and just kind of highlight the woodwork. We're just going to keep working. Just repeat the same process on the top that you did on the sides and then wait for that to dry and finish off with the top coat of your choice. I don't have any finished photos of this particular piece as the client decided to go a different direction. But here are some photos from a previous piece that I have done. 